If you're a homeowner, there are very few phrases that strike as much fear and curiosity as when does a late mortgage payment gets reported to the credit bureaus? Today I'm venturing into this nerve wracking territory and uncovering the hidden truth behind those dreaded late payments. We all know the feeling of the clock is ticking, the calendar days are slipping by, and that mortgage payment, it's still pending. What happens next? How does this single act echo through your financial life, impacting your credit score, your borrowing ability, and even your peace of mind? Stay tuned as I unravel the mystery. From the immediate consequences of that first late payment to the haunting shadow it casts on your credit report for years, we'll explore the dreaded domino effect of multiple late payments leading down a path that could end in foreclosure. And we want to avoid foreclosure at all costs. There's tension, lessons, and crucial advice for every homeowner in this video. Prepare yourself for a deep dive into the unknowns of late mortgage payments. Are you ready to face the facts and learn how to navigate these? Let's get started. Telling you, for every homeowner or anyone dreaming of owning a home, when does a late payment get reported? This isn't just about missing a deadline, it's about understanding the ripple effects on your credit and your future. We'll explore the journey of late mortgage payments from the moment it's missed all the way through the credit reporting and finally to its long-standing impact on your credit report. This is a journey that can last up to seven years and it's packed with lessons and warnings. So if you're a first-time home buyer, a seasoned homeowner, or just curious about real estate and mortgages, this video right here is packed. Are you ready? Let's go. Let's start at the beginning. You've missed your mortgage payment for the first time. It's easy to do. Life gets busy and sometimes things slip through the cracks. We all have that happen to us at least once. Most lenders understand this and offer a grace period typically around 15 days. This grace period is like a financial safety net, giving you a little extra time without any negative consequences. But what happens if you miss the safety net? What happens then? If your payment is 30 days late, that's when things starts to shift a little bit. Your lender may report this to the credit bureaus, and they totally can. This first report is like a small little blot on a clean sheet. It might seem minor at first, but it's really significant. This late payment will now start its seven-year term on your credit report, beginning to influence your credit worthiness. It's important to understand the weight of this first mark. While one late payment won't really ruin your credit score, it does leave an impression though. Lenders view it as a sign of potential risk. It's a wake-up call, reminding you of the importance of timely payments and financial management. And so what if you miss another payment, right? Ooh, now you're 60 days late and the situation starts to escalate a little bit. Each missed payment is reported separately on the credit report, and each one is another ding to your credit score. It's like adding more weight to an already burdened ship. The load gets heavier and the ship sinks faster. If this pattern continues and you miss a third mortgage payment, you're now 90 days late. This is a significant red flag for lenders, and it should be a serious signal to you as well. It's not just about the multiple negative entries on your credit report now. It's about the message it sends. It suggests a pattern financial instability, and lenders take this very, very seriously. This third late payment is often the point where lenders start considering more severe actions like foreclosure. Each of these late payments individually stay on your credit report for seven years. They accumulate, creating a long-term narrative of your financial habits. Not good. The more late payments you have, the harder it becomes to recover from all of the delinquencies. It affects your ability to get a new credit, secure favorable loan terms, and in some cases, even it impacts your job prospecting. But let's not dwell on the doom and gloom here because I'm all about the solutions. If you find yourself in this situation, there's a path to recovery. The impact of late payments reduces over time, especially if they're isolated incidents. The most recent two years of credit reported are the most critical for your credit score. So the sooner you can realign with timely payments, 
the quicker your credit starts to recover. The best strategy, however, is prevention. So how do we prevent this? You can do this by setting up automatic payments. This is actually a great way to ensure you never miss a deadline, right? You can also do things like creating a budget that prioritizes your mortgage payments, and that can also keep you on track. And if you're facing financial hardship, then consider it's crucial to communicate with your lender. They often have programs or solutions that can help like modifying your loan terms or even a temporary forbearances. I have a video I recently did that's titled your mortgage payment is late. Here's what to do. Consider watching that at some point soon. And remember a late payment doesn't really define you or your financial future. It's an opportunity to reassess and adjust your financial planning. Stay informed and stay proactive and engage with your finances. With the right approach, you can navigate through this and come out stronger on the other side. But remember, these marks can stay on your credit report for up to seven years. And with smart management, their impact can be mitigated. If you are learning something new now and finding this information helpful, please give it a like. It means the world to me. In today's journey into the world of late mortgage payments, I want to remind you that this isn't just a channel, it's a resource. Here we dive deep into not just the challenges, but also the solutions that homeowners like you face every day. If you're worried about foreclosure or seeking ways to protect your home, we've got a treasure trove of information right here. Our videos are packed with expert advice on preventing foreclosure, strategies to save your house, and insights into navigating the complex world of real estate. I'm here to empower you with knowledge and options. And speaking of insights, you don't want to miss my next video, Do You Get Money If Your House Is Foreclosed? It's a question that many homeowners ponder in tough times. I'll break down the realities, the possibilities, and what you can actually expect if you find yourself in this situation. It's an eye opener you definitely don't want to miss. So make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell, and join our community for all the latest updates and insights. Remember, knowledge is power, especially when it comes to protecting your most valuable asset, your home. Until next time, keep informed and stay empowered and take control of your financial future. And most importantly, do not lose your house to foreclosure. Thank you for watching and I will see you soon.